Okay, so Microsoft Word has this feature where misspellings are underlined with the red squiggly line, grammar with the blue lines, and then you may come across a situation where you haven't got any spelling or grammar errors, but you still get this dashed blue line. So I want to show you how to hide these features in your Word document. Well, for example, Rapid IT is the name of the company, and it's always going to think that that's a spelling error. One option you have is to right click into an instance of that word and you can add it to the dictionary. And when you do that, it will no longer think it's a spelling error. And I'll just undo that. But you can see that I've got quite a few kind of package names here that don't represent a spelling that Microsoft Word understands or recognizes. So really what I want to do is get rid of all these features, even this Suppose it grammar error where I'm leaving a space between the word and the colon. Now, to do that for this document, what you need to do is go to File, and then down to Options, then to Proofing, and then there's a section called Exceptions For, and you can say for the particular document you're in, and I'm in Document 3, you want to hide spelling errors, and you want to hide grammar errors. If I click on OK, you can see it gets rid of those red squiggly lines and the double blue underlines. It hasn't got rid of this feature down here, but I will explain that later on. Now, if you just generally don't want this feature in Word at all, what you can do is go to File, Options, Back to Proofing. And you can basically turn the whole spelling and grammar checking off just by unticking these options here. Check spelling as you type, mark grammar errors as you type, and that will affect every document that you open in Word. For me, I'm not going to uncheck those options because it was only within this document that I had this problem of words that it didn't recognize. Generally, your grammar and spelling checker are useful things to have in your document. But what's with this option down here? Now this feature here indicates inconsistent formatting in your document. And if I select this text here, you can see that the font size is 10.5, whereas the rest of the paragraph is size 11. So it's quite useful that it's pointed that out. It wasn't too obvious just looking at the paragraph that this sentence had a different font size. Now, if you want to turn that feature off, you need to go to File, Options, advanced and under editing options there's a checkbox here keep track of formatting and then mark formatting inconsistencies so if you untick that option there click on ok you'll no longer see the dashed blue underline in your document i'll we'll turn it back on i can actually get rid of this instance of the underlining just by right clicking and going to replace direct formatting with style normal and that actually resolves the formatting issue okay so that's all i wanted to cover in this particular video hopefully that's useful if it is please give me a thumbs up and subscribe and i'll see you next video